Brakes are an important system to the operation of your vehicle. When you hear a squeal, that's a warning signal. It could be caused by the wear indicator on your brake pads. It tells you when you need new brakes. But more about that later. First, Brakes 101. What's the difference between disc and drum brakes? Both apply friction to stop your vehicle. And with disc brakes, your foot on the brake pedal activates the hydraulic fluid that engages the piston and the caliper to press the brake pads against the rotor. Now the rotor and the wheel are attached to the hub. The friction of the brake pads against the rotor stops the hub, the wheel, and the vehicle. With drum brakes like these on the rear, the same foot action creates hydraulic pressure against the wheel cylinder, which pushes out the brake shoes against the drum. Now the friction of the shoes against the drum stops the wheel and the vehicle. Some drivers are sensitive to how well their brakes are functioning, but sometimes it's hard to tell when the brakes are getting worn and it's time for maintenance. That's where the squealer comes in. This little clip on the doorstop pad is the squealer. It's a built-in wear indicator that makes a high-pitched warning sound when the brake pads are worn and new pads are needed. The brake wear warning sound means that soon your brakes will not work well, and that could lead to an accident. When you hear the warning sound of the wear indicator, have your vehicle serviced. And be sure to use new approved GM replacement parts. And to help reduce noise and brake dust, GM offers Durastop ceramic brake pads. It's also a good idea to have your front and rear brakes checked every time you take your vehicle in for an oil change. For additional information on brakes, check your owner's manual. And to keep your vehicle and your brakes safe and sound, just see Mr. Goodwrench at one of the nearly 7,000 GM dealers nationwide.